Hey y'all, Kate Price is here. So here is your September 2019 mid-month reading. Hey Leo, Kate Price is here. Let's do it. So Leo, um, hmm. Couple things. Um, are you planning to end something or you want something and are you trying to transform something from an ending to something great? I mean, be your best person. I mean, you know, do you, but I think there may, okay. So somebody's trying to stop arguing about something that, or deciding to go ahead and do the right damn thing instead of the bullshit they've been doing, or maybe they was dragging you through the mud and you just feel like emotionally, like I see you being exhausted and you like being in a way like, I ain't got time for this bullshit, but I love this person. You know, it's just like, I don't trust them. I don't know if you have a reason not to trust them. Maybe you just, you know, your little spidey sense is tingling. But I think that you may be trying to decide which way this relationship going to go. All right. You may be wanting to see someone or wanting to invest in somebody. And it's just like not working. Maybe you're doing too much. Maybe you're giving them too much. Maybe they, if this person is not reciprocating what the hell it is you doing. Okay. If they ain't giving you back what you're giving to them. What the fuck is you doing? For real. Like, what are you doing? I think you guys may have been... I mean, because Leos are loving people. So I wonder if... Um, if you being good to somebody... Not knowing what they're really feeling. You know? Like, is there some conf confusion about what direction this relationship going to go? Do you not feel this person is, is living up to what... They're not working on shit like they you working on it? You know? Is there a lot of confusion? Because I feel like somebody on this end, somebody wants to do something. Somebody wants this thing to grow, but somebody else is not really making a move like they're supposed to. Or somebody's not um, trying to improve upon whatever the fuck it is y'all doing now, you know. I think you may have a conversation about this because it's really getting on your nerves and you know what to do. I think that you, okay. So this person may feel attacked when you tell their ass, look here, um, mm, I ain't feeling the love, Okay. I think they may feel attacked, okay? And in this case, if they feel attacked, you may turn cold in the ass and, and dip out. You may be like, you know what? Fuck this shit. I think you may wait them out. You know, I think you have, may have somebody sweating, okay? Unless this is you. I mean, mm, um, I think that uh, somebody may beg you back. If you walk away from them, I don't know if you already have gone through this or, or somebody's trying to beg you back now, but I think someone may beg you back even because you're tired of this bullshit and you're tired of talking about it. They may want back in after they do the shit they do to you. Maybe you're tired of bickering or it seems like you fighting against, you're fighting a wall. You know, it's just like, I'm trying to tell them how I feel and they're not giving, giving a fuck. They're not listening to me. Um, they're not, you know what I mean? They're not willing to be open to dialogue nothing they just want to do what the fuck they want to do they they closing their ears okay so what i see is somebody you know putting their fingers in their ears and being real childish about shit you know it's just like for real like i'm trying to talk to you so they think it's a game think it's a game and you not with this so you may lose your shit let me tell you something uh unless you got some bail money or you ready to lose everything do not get your ass in trouble okay dial 911 for emergencies matter of fact don't dial 911 for emergencies let me just say that. And um, just don't do it. All right? Don't do it. Don't do it. And do not get yourself involved. If you feel about to lose control, do not do that shit. Okay? Drive off. And don't drive into a pole. And don't drive into their ass. And don't drive into their house. Just don't do it. Okay? Just... I think this, this, this situation will be repaired. But I think after some... Some realization on both ends... Either you realize you got to deal with this person on their level. Maybe they're not as mature as you. Maybe they don't want the same thing as you. Even though maybe they want the same thing as you, but they can't give you what you need right now because they're not understanding the level you on, okay? And they can't get it. So, I mean, you got to decide, you know, if you want to wait around for kindergarten to grow up, you know what I'm saying? And um, I think some things may be repaired, but I also feel like... You may be over and done with this shit. Is you already cheating on somebody? Okay, because I feel like somebody already going out. Or somebody thinking about going out. And maybe they dealing with somebody else or talking to somebody else who 
seems like they have better conversations with the other person. But this one person you may be talking to, if you're talking to somebody on the side, maybe somebody that's not in your vicinity. So it may be kind of hard for y'all to get together, which should kind of be a good thing at this time because you're not really sure what you're going to do about this thing. Okay. Um, and depending on what the hell you want to do, I mean, it's going to be a little bit of thought put in this, a little bit of thought. A whole lot of thought put into this about whatever it is. Because I think you maybe get to the, point, to the point where you ready to give your motherfucking shit to somebody else. I mean, your whole... I don't want to say your shit as in your genitals. I mean, when I say that, you ready to give your goodness to somebody else. Because you, this person that... They, you feel like either they ain't worth it or just not somebody you want to be with anymore. Because of, you know... Because just because, you know, somebody may look good, it may not be shit, you know on the inside maybe maybe they good to look at but they're really not they just ain't there you know it's just not their relationship is not there they're not mature enough they're not doing and you may go on about your business and i think you may i don't want to say you're gonna be alone alone at all i feel like someone else may be coming in or somebody may be waiting in the wings right now i mean what the fuck you doing leo but someone may be waiting in the wings and but they come at you stupid too so i mean that can be fixed but I think that you really need need to deal and you want to deal with the situation you've got right in front of you right now. Okay? It don't have to break up. It just need to get better. And this other person needs to be completely understanding. I mean, I can't say need to be understanding. You need to be very clear about the fuck it is you want to do and what you don't, what you're not going to do and what they're not going to do. Okay? And what they're not going to do is, you know give you this childish ass act this fucking monkey in a motherfucking box and shit i don't know why i said that shit okay um fucking uh behavior and you giving them you know what i'm saying uh complete respect and they give you some bullshit i mean you leo fuck that shit don't take that <laughs> really okay really and truly do not take that shit because you're not supposed to take that you a leo come on now do not take that shit So I think that's all I have for you, Leo. I hope you understand and much love to y'all. And I'll see you soon. Bye.